Aritzia is having their annual clientele sale very, very soon. So I wanted to talk to you guys about my recommendations and what's currently in my cart. I've been shopping at Aritzia for 10 years now. Yes, I did the math. So I have quite a bit of favorites and based on my personal experience and preference, I would say my all-time favorites are their bodycon dresses and cardigans. I have this black one from TNA and I love this because it's so stretchy. It's actually thick because I think it's double layer. So there's like double layer of fabric. It just makes it so much more durable and I can wear this with tights, throw on a jacket on its own. I mean, I even went clubbing in it. So this kind of silhouette i just love and aritzia does a lot of them and now that summer is coming around i have been eyeing on this dress right here from babaton i have something really really similar from princess polly i got like five years ago so i definitely do need a replacement since it's white and it's starting to get a little bit dirty and that one looks exactly like this the same length the same neckline this really incredible thick stretchy like rib material and that dress is one of my all-time favorite like summer staples so i really really need to pick up another one again it's such a flattering piece and like the most perfect summer dress and if you want more of a seamless look like if you don't like this like rib kind of material they also do this in the contour mini dress this is also from babaton and again so many different colors speaking of this sculpt knit fabric they do this a ton in so many different pieces including the one that i'm wearing right now this is called their sweetheart top i love this top because of the fabric it's stretchy but it's not restricting and this actually has a little bit of what is this like a rubber like right on the rim so it kind of like holds your chest together it doesn't like slip down and because of the shape in the front it's so flattering on your chest and i've worn this on a night out so many times super super comfortable it just keeps you in shape and even during the day when it's hot just throw on this tube top and some kind of like short skirt and you're really good to go also in this sculpt knit fabric i also have the tank top i have so many pieces from aritzia and have done a lot of videos on aritzia so i will link them down in the description box this piece i brought it out to show you guys you can tell it's like the same piece and what i love about this is the color this is called matte pearl so if you don't want that stark white you can check this one out in terms of the length this is their regular like classic one but they do also have it in a cropped version i love when aritzia does pieces in this fabric and also give you that waistline it's easy to kind of tuck it in your pants skirt what have you and then also it gives you more of a shape in this fabric you can see it's very very stretchy so it's really really comfortable but it does not stretch out throughout the day the next top i want to talk about is very similar it's the same like sculpt knit fabric but in a different silhouette so you can see it's a v-neck in the front and back so i feel like this piece is very different and it kind of elevates your look a little bit more and even though it's a v-neck it's not like a plunge so it is still daytime appropriate this again is in the shade matte pearl you can see they're pretty much identical in the same color i have this in black as well which i've worn to death i love wearing it with like a black satin skirt on a summer night just love it it's such an easy outfit moving on to cardigans there's one that aritzia does that I have in three different colors. It's their plunge cardigan. You can tell how much I love this thing. When something's popular on Ritzia, they just keep bringing it back in like different colors season after season. So they still do make it and they have all these like new colors, but are we kind of done with them? Like, I don't know. I'm kind of sad to see them go, but they've been around for a long time, at least six years that I know of. I still think it's somewhat classic, but because I've worn them so many times, like you guys have probably seen them in a lot of my videos over the years. So I haven't really been reaching for them, but I still think it's a classic look it's flowy but it does cinch you in at the waist so it gives you a little bit of a shape and they just look so flattering with so many bottoms so let me know what you guys think next is babaton's georgia cardigan i have this in black and i love 
love love love this piece i don't think they have this in black anymore but in general what i wanted to talk about is any cardigan that you can wear as a top this again is super flattering long sleeve not oversized at all but it's not super tight either but it has like a v that's not too plungy and also it's somewhat cropped i think this piece is phenomenal it's so perfect i can wear this with just leggings and i'm good to go or like leather leggings skirts i will say though the fabric isn't the softest i can see why some people might find it a little bit scratchy but at this price point i didn't expect it to be perfect and aritzia does this kind of silhouette a lot so i still wanted to mention it in case you guys were looking for a cardigan that you can wear as a top another cardigan i want to mention is this cashmere one they do have more like a higher quality pieces that's like a hundred percent cashmere or like cashmere slash wool and this i would say was definitely an investment i have this really light cream color and because it's a hundred percent cashmere it's very very soft with most pieces from aritzia i always go for like my true size which is extra small and this one is slightly oversized but it's not too oversized just like the picture here it looks so good with like dresses or skirts it's such a feminine piece so i love this one the last cardigan i want to talk about is from wilfred the Faye cardigan i think this is new and i love this in black instead of wearing t-shirts in the summertime i think wearing a knitted top like this kind of makes your outfit look a little bit more interesting and more put together i think this would look so good with a mini skirt just like the model like a black leather skirt and this top i love it i mean what is an aritzia video from my channel without these daria pants you guys have seen these leggings on me so many times but hands down these are one of the best faux leather leggings out there at this price point both my pairs are the cropped version but i think they got rid of it and now on the same product page you can see them in three different lengths short regular tall on my high which is 5 3 the short or the cropped version is perfect because it hits you right at the ankle so nothing like bunches up these leggings last forever i mean like my black one just started to go a little bit but it's because i wore them every single year for the past like seven years or so so considering that like they are really really good quality they're super flattering but not too high-waisted so they're just perfect and of course i have to mention the super puff i finally got one in this gorgeous blue color let me show you i got this in new york back in march and it was from the super puff store so i don't know if it's like a new york only kind of thing but they have a whole store dedicated to just super puff jackets which is absolutely insane i got this in this color because this is like the closest thing i could get to the prada puffer jacket the color is slightly different but it's still kind of that shiny effect and then also this gorgeous light blue color i actually got this in two extra small even though my true size is extra small when i tried that on it felt still kind of too big so i went down a size and it's perfect it comes with the hood which is detachable so it's pretty much off 24 7 it has all these details inside and it has the little finger like sleeve thing has a finger hole and all my dog hair this is kind of like my dog walking jacket i just throw this on and when i pull this jacket out my dog knows we're going for a walk this does keep me warm but in terms of like the different levels i think this is kind of somewhere in between so it's not the warmest jacket but it still gets the job done overall it is very very well made i can definitely take this when i go like skiing and stuff i love this fun bright color because it doesn't make me look too dull in the winter time i have another bodycon dress for you guys it is the cove dress from wilfred i don't think they have the same exact one anymore mine was called heather gray or something but now they have something called Murado gray which looks very very similar it's kind of like a lilac -y gray color it is so flattering it's a v-neck has a collar and the length is what makes this dress so elegant and feminine it's not a mini dress it's like somewhere in between a mini and a midi so it just looks so classy these sweatshorts from tna i kid you not i wear them every single day like it's 
It's a little embarrassing to admit that. I got these a couple years ago and I have not stopped wearing them. I have them in heather chrome, but look at this new lavender color. I saw that they have a whole range of this lavender color, which is so beautiful. But these, I'm telling you, you need these like right now. Dog walking shorts, running errands shorts, getting grocery shorts, like perfection. Okay, moving on to what's actually in my cart right now. I told you guys I love bodycon dresses. I mean, that's pretty much all I wear these days. This seamless contour one, I don't know, this color just really spoke to me, the total eclipse. It's kind of like a navy color, but in between. Just looks so flawless and cute Ooh, with the blazer too. So I'll be picking that up in extra small. And then this one, this is on final sale. I actually did see this last year around like winter time and I was kind of debating whether or not I should get it. it seems to be like a ribbed knit kind of fabric. Looks a little thin, but I just love this purple color. I think it would just be like one of those very casual dresses that I can throw on with like a jacket. And then I just told you guys about these sweat shorts. I mean, look at this color, the echo gray. What is this color? It's like greenish turquoise. I love it. Oh, this is what it kind of looks like on. It's not too short. It's not too long, but it's like right in between. That's why I love this length. And I also saved it in the lavender color as well. I mean, just look at this color. It's the perfect lavender shade. They did very, very well with this. I also love that these shorts don't have raw hems. I feel like those will kind of make them less durable. I feel like this is more of a cleaner look. And also these shorts have pockets. So I'm telling you, they're amazing. And then I think I'm finally gonna take the plunge and get the zip up hoodie. Still can't decide whether I want just the perfect one or the boyfriend zip hoodie. I just keep finding myself reaching for a zip up hoodie like this in this heather gray color, especially for like the airport or just running errands. It's like a key staple like everyone needs. And I love that they still made a boyfriend kind of fit for shorter girls. So I think if I choose my size, which is extra small and my height, it won't make me look too frumpy. So I'm excited for this one. And I mentioned these sculpt knit bodycon dresses, both in white and black. They're just like a staple, staple, staple item in my closet. And then the Faye cardigan. I'm in love with this black one. It's so pretty. Those are all my recommendations for the upcoming Aritzia clientele sale. That is a mouthful. I hope you guys found this useful and helpful and that you can actually see what I'm personally thinking of buying. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye!